Hi friends welcome to my channel world. And today we're going to make with you a natural and very relevant fertilizer for winter. It is suitable for almost all of our indoor plants and for anthurium and spathophyllum and snakeaculcus. For orchids it will be very relevant and it is best to use it now, in the winter period, that is January to February, the best time for this fertilizer. We're going to need a whole bunch of ingredients today. They will all complement each other optimally. And let's get started. Here's our first ingredient, which is two garlic cloves. They just need to be cleaned. Garlic contains a very large number of nutrients, vitamins, minerals, antioxidants. Garlic has a lot of phyton sides that chase away all the pests in our plants. And that will be the first link of our feeding today. Peel the second slice. That's it. Now we need to chop the garlic. Not too fine, but chunks like this, let's say medium. Here, we cut our garlic into slices like this. The peel should have been removed with a plausible one, of course. And we're on to the next step. Now add 300 milliliters to the container, as a minimum it should contain. Because in the first step, we need 300 milliliters of water. Here's what we got. Now we'll take regular rice. 3 tablespoons. We're gonna need. The rice is above. 3 tablespoons. Well, without the slide, I mean. I took a slide, so it's a little less. I'll make one last spoonful. Well, there's nothing wrong with rehashing rice in general. The rice is ready. A very gentle substance for plants, so nothing strange. Our rice is also rich in nutrients, vitamins, but different. And they will complement each other with garlic. Leave it all in a warm place for an hour. By the way, the water should be about 40 to 50 degrees initially. Warm water so that all of our ingredients maximize the benefits. Water. I have a battery here. You can insert even on it. Well, it's a matter of whose battery allows. It's been an hour or so. And that's what we're doing. Onward. We need to strain our fertilizer so there are no chunks. I've already added water there. It's a watering can of about 1 liter. And now we need to bring it up to 1 liter. All of our substance. For further action. Okay. Now it's our job to bring in the humates. It's a substance like this. It's sold in many different forms. Here. I have it like I do with other substances with fertilizer. But it's better, of course, to buy the clean version. But I figured since they're already here, I'd better use what I have. Humates are a very important part for this fertilizer, because they are what help the plant absorb all the nutrients from the garlic and rice we've already used. And without humates, it won't be 100% as potent. And let's add them already. We'll only need half a teaspoon. A whole liter. Moist. Gumatop. We didn't have much. A little, a lot. But I don't have them in their purest form. I think you can use a little more than that. Here you go. Add to our fertilizer, stir well. Now the main thing is to water our plant. It's versatile, it's a fertilizer, a big plus. 
You can make your whole collection happy with these useful substances at once. Here you go. You can do both with a putophile and an orchid infusion. And your plants will be happy about it. So here it is. Pour. Of course, I didn't choose the best watering can. But I'm comfortable cooking here. In this way, all our plants will be happy, watered, and will accelerate their growth. Friends, thank you for watching. Be sure to share this video with your friends, because that way more plants will be happy, beautiful and healthy. More people will know, which means more plants will be in good condition and beautiful. To please their owners. See you very soon in a new video. You might as well appreciate it. Then it will also spread more. Thanks for watching, bye everyone.